Let's go back. Did y'all think of Dr. Dredd? He's, he's a pretty cool guy, but he don't understand my way of thinking. So, I had to send him home. I still have to fix his ambulance, though. <sighs> Take a number. Right, today, a couple little uh, deals for you. I'm going to put the herd on some Zamac. I'm going to uh, remember the little uh, block that I had. Look at the bottom of hogged out. And uh, I'm not going to melt any Hot Wheels today because I've already melted them a while back and made these little ingots. And uh, so I melt them down and I pour them into old bearing races. And uh, it just makes these little ingots of nice clean material that you can use for whatever. Uh, I want to get into doing some green sand casting. So uh, that's kind of what I'm prepping for. Maybe in the next 8-10 years I'll get into some green sand casting. Uh, so for right now, I'm going to take this ingot and I'm going to melt her. I'm going to use my big, uh, uh, it's called a brush torch for like burning weeds and stuff. I don't know that I'd use it around here in my neighborhood, but uh, I use it for burning crap. Because as you know, I like to burn things. So let's get this thing fired up. Melt some Zamek. There's a turbo feature. You like that? So we're put our little block over here. Get that ready for some molten Zamek. And then you guys have been asking about decanting uh, paint. So I'm gonna. Uh, I'm not gonna do it in the same area because I'll probably end up blowing myself up. Uh, gloss black. Oh, this is gloss black. And this is also gloss black. So I got these prepped for decant. You know, a lot of times you get spray paint, and the uh, you know the, the just the paint don't come out anymore, and the thing's half full of paint. So I'll show you how to do that. <coughs> Um, I'm gonna put my camera right here. Will that work? Basically, decanting paint. Requires nothing more. Nothing, oh come on, there it is. Once again, you prepare. All right, forget it. Nothing more than uh, drilling a hole in your can. Before you do that, though, you want to put a little rag over it. So whatever comes out doesn't get all over you. Okay, that was a fail. Let me get it started first. Keep doing Max. What are you doing? I should have drilled a smaller hole. <laughs> Alright. I didn't say it wasn't going to be messy. I didn't say it was going to be messy. Alright. Nice. I probably shouldn't have uh, pulled a drill bit out. That was a mistake. But how do we learn if we don't make mistakes? Mm. Alright. Anyway, so what you want to do is let that gas out. <clears throat> Just let it sit. And um, you can still feel the um, 
the chemicals gassing out of the little hole. So let that sit for a day or so. Paint won't dry up. And then you can pour it into a um, little paint jar. Throw it in your airbrush. Use it. Utilize it. All right, now I gotta clean up my hands are all sticky. They're all sticky. All right, let's go see how our Zamax doing. It's a little quickie. Uh, a little quickie deal before I go to work. Can't I really can't get started on a project because I gotta leave it work in an hour or so. So anyway, here you go. Decant and paint. So there's a mess. Uh oh, I'm running low on battery. Oh crap. <coughs> Uh, she's not even melted yet. What the heck? They have to do this in a two-parter. Two-parter. It's gonna have to be a two-parter. Would fail. Fail, 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 fail. All right. Well, I guess um, I'm gonna have to do this in a second part. So maybe I'll throw the battery in the charger and uh, see what I can do. So I'll catch you later. I'll be back. I'll be back. Don't worry. Okay. Cut. Okay. So I'm back, and uh, we got our little deal hogged out, and we have our molten Zamac, about 500 degrees. Okay. Now I'm going to try to, uh, I better not do it one handed, pretty, pretty dangerous, got my tripod set up now, so, okay, it's implied that this is dangerous stuff and that uh, I probably shouldn't mess with the stuff if you're a kid. There you go. We poured our little doodad there. Let's put this back in the far. Take a look. Take a look. <clears throat> well, She's still molten. Let's go, uh... It's the woods acting as an insulation, uh, deal. Oh, no! <laughs> well, it's actually scorching the inside of my block. Which can't be good. Man, I got molten crap everywhere now. Alright. Doggone it. Hey, it's the fail channel, remember? Let's put a little bit more in it. Let's see what we can do. See what we can do. Gotta cool that bad boy off. Here, I'll be right back. I'm gonna leave the camera rolling. I think what happens is going to happen is, eh, maybe, I don't know, we'll see. 
Anyway, you have it. Big giant mess. Can't even get it off the stand now. Nice. Total fail. Complete. This is probably one of my better failures. Let's pick up the uh, the stuff that I dropped and we'll recycle it. Yeah, you don't want to spill any of this stuff on you, man. <clears throat> It'll burn you. It'll burn you big time. It'll burn you. <clears throat> There's a little art piece there for you. Okay. So in the process of charging my battery, I decided I'm gonna I'm gonna burn some bodies. <clears throat> I got a couple of Holden pickups, a couple of tractors, the base off the Ratmobile, and a Matchbox truck. Start with a Ratmobile. Burn them down. Truck in there. We'll put the tractor in there. Tractor in there. And I'll turn up the heat. There you go. How's our block doing? Yeah, it's all cooled off. I was wondering if uh, it didn't loosen my epoxy. So I screwed the epoxy in there. It's got some nice weight to it. I don't know if it'll hold the body or not. But... It's still kind of warm. I will let it cool. It's an experiment. It's all an experiment, man. Life is an experiment. All right. Get to burning some bot days. Throw them in there, paint and all. You don't have to strip them. They'll burn the paint right off of them. Oh, there goes the Ratmobile. She's starting to go down. She's starting to go down. This soup is two parts uh, tractor, one part truck, one part Ratmobile, and two parts Holden pickup. That's the stew we're making for today. There goes the truck. Look at that, man. It's all twisted up now. She's a twisted mess. All the paint's going away. There, oh, the whole front just came off of that bad boy. There you go. The tractor going by by his left of the tractor. Right, we're making some nice soup. Alright, now we'll add our. We'll let that simmer and we'll add a couple of holding trucks. There you go. I got my little uh, bearing race here set up here so we can pour another ink. We'll get our holding trucks. We'll get them uh, nice and crispy. Just stir it around in there. Get all the dross to the top. Dross is all the. I'm not a metallurgist, by the way. I just take this crap up on the fly. The dross is all the impurities and paint and junk. It goes floats to the top and it'll actually stick to a dissimilar metal, whatever you're melting there, and uh, you can clean it out so you don't have any impurities in your molten goo. Oh, there goes the top of the, oh, the molten truck's turned green. It turns a, a lovely shade of green, and the red one's turned a lovely shade of brown. They're melting nicely now. We'll be ready for our souffle. Cooking with the pooch man. It's getting a little warm there. I'm manipulating the screwdriver. There we go. Everything's in a nice soupy puddle now. Beautiful. Beautiful. We'll be ready for lunch in no time at all.
wonder what I should have with it. What do you think of some crepes? Maybe a, uh, a nice butternut squash? I don't know. I don't know. What goes good with Zamac? All right, here's all the here's all the junk. Get rid of the junk. All the junk. Let's throw it on the floor. I'll clean it up later. There you go. All the draw. All the draw. Oh, my camera don't melt. It smells like it's melting. <laughs> Pretty good. Okay, here we go. We'll turn the fire off, and uh, let me see if I could do this without killing myself. Set this over here like that. What I do for my fans, I tell you. All right. So we have our melting zamak, our zamak soup. We're gonna pour it in our ink. It. There you go. I got a little bit left over. What should I do with it? What should I do with it? I'll just I'll pour a blob on the thing here. On my workbench, just a blob. We'll make a Zmag blob right there. Then I'll melt that down later. There you go. Made that out of half inch of square tubing, and this is half of a sphere at the metal. Fence park store thingamajigger. There you go. Here you go. Decanting, uh, melting Hot Wheels, burning and playing with fire, cooking with Mr. Joe. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this episode out here in the Crazy Man Workshop where the craziness never ends. And I will see you later. Peace out.